Good evening, YouTube. Or you should I say good afternoon. Ugly Prepper here. We're going to try making this video on my tablet. Uh, maybe it'll make a better video. Maybe not. Was going to unbox. Uh, was going to wait. I've got a few more things coming in that I ordered. But uh, it looks like they're being delayed. So I thought I would go ahead and go through the things I've got right here. Do, a, uh, do some unboxing and some talking about what I got. Uh, get over there. Um, we have the Battery Daddy. This is the stored battery storage organizer I was telling you folks about that I had ordered on one of the last few videos. Uh, so I got it. Uh, it this came in yesterday. And uh, so we got it. I can't wait to play with it. I can't wait to see if all my batteries will fill it up or not. You know, I said something about all the... I've got a drawer full of batteries in there. And uh, I can't wait to use the tester to see how many. Because, you know, you always get batteries in the bottom of your drawer. You know, they get dropped in there. Then you can't remember if they're good or not. So I, I'm, I really can't wait to use this tester to see how many good batteries I actually have. So, uh, let's see. Hey, come out of here. And come on. Get that out of the way. Here it is, folks. Here is the battery daddy. Um here's Got some stuff here in the other side. I'll take it out. That's my phone going off. Um, let's take these papers out here so you can get a good look at it. All double A's on this side. All double A's. So, uh, and I believe there's even two that goes in the handle. That'll be handy. And then over here, you've got, uh, looks like D's, C's, the triple A's, um, nine volts, one, two, three A's. So, uh, oh yeah, I can't wait to whip this bad boy out here and, uh, put my batteries in it. You've got a little, uh, it's hard to see, but you've got a little spot down here to keep your, like, coin batteries in. Uh, and then this is the tester. It's hard to see with this light. But that is the tester, the battery tester. So, uh, yeah, man, I can't wait to see how many actually good batteries I have. So, I wanted to show you all that. Uh, the Sensible Prepper did a review on this. So, uh, if y'all want to go and watch it over there, the Sensible Prepper. Okay. We got that. Okay, I gotta get all this other stuff out of the way. Watch out, doggy. I quit using Amazon after they shut down Parlor. Um, I have went to Overstock.com uh, for a lot of the things that I buy. Um, and I've noticed that at Overstock, once you click on something to really get in there and look at it, if you'll scroll all the way down to the bottom, Overstock actually tells you where the product comes from. I don't remember Amazon doing that. I really like that. So. Okay, this is a big box right here. Watch out, puppy dogs. And here we have uh, the, uh, I believe they're called water bricks. These are three and a half gallon. I know I'm barely in the camera. But these are three and a half gallon uh fresh drinking water storage and there's the spout and you got a little handle that wants to come off I may just take these off but uh, you know here's your come on work it out there's your, your lid you fill these up uh, and you know this is three and a half gallons of fresh drinking water you can store 
and you know with, with all the stuff going on in texas right now and uh well i actually bought these before that happened but hey what a what a good reminder to have some of these so I actually there's a again uh there's eight of these in the box uh so yeah it's only eight uh but you gotta start somewhere okay uh you know i just can't afford to go and buy like uh, 100 of these doggone things and have 300 gallons of water or more than that because of three and a half gallon but yeah these uh i bought some of these i've got eight of them and uh if my math is correct i believe that'll be about 29 gallons of water storage uh for for just me uh I store water to wash my hands in and water for the dogs. I store that kind of water in these large clear apple juice containers. I, I drink a lot of apple juice. It's my favorite juice. And since we have those big tall clear, they're heavy duty plastic containers, I store that kind of water in those. This will be for drinking only. And um, I found the information I was looking for uh, on the Provident Preppers. Uh, the, you can look them up on YouTube. The Provident Preppers, they actually have a channel. And uh, I believe the name of the video is Emergency Water Storage. So if you're looking for uh, how to prepare your water for storage, I found everything I needed to know in there. Uh, and also, I believe um, City Prepping has a good one as well. So I did find the information that I was wanting on those. And uh, so I just wanted to go over these. I like them. They look, they look pretty tough. I know there's a video out there that says the aqua brick is better. Um, but uh, I like the looks of these. These are stackable. You can stack them up. Uh, you can stack them in the bottom of a closet or uh, under things or, you know, under your bed. Uh, so I like that. And you can keep them in your home and uh, keep them out of the sunlight. So that's why I went for these. And, uh, and they just stack so easily. I love that. But, yeah, I um, wanted to go over a couple things that I got in. I've got a vacuum sealer and some more stuff coming in, but uh, uh, it's been delayed a day or two, so I went ahead and decided to make the video today. Hope everyone's doing well. Um, the Warrior Poet Society, that guy, he made a video the other day, and the video was about something else, but in there he talks about using your money as your voice spending your money where you spend your money can can make a lot of difference and you know i talked about dropping amazon and uh you know i don't care if there if there's something i have to buy and i have to go buy something from five different websites i'll do it to keep from using amazon I, i'm not doing amazon anymore they're so handy, and they, they are very handy, but uh, I'm not going to do that anymore. My voice, my dollars that I spend have a voice, and uh, right now, um, what did I say this came from? Overstock is getting a lot of my business now, and uh, if I need survival gear or something to that effect, there's um, um, Sportsman's Guide's a great place to get ammo cans and stuff from. <clears throat> and uh, goinggear.com is a place to get survival items, knives, saws, that type of place. I believe they're in, in Georgia. Y'all oh, excuse me. But uh thought we would go over these. I can't wait to get my marker out. I'm gonna put uh I'm gonna put uh, fresh water drinking only and stick a date on here. Uh I'll say something to the effect of drink or uh recycle water by such and such date so uh these two things here will keep me busy for a little while but uh hope everybody is staying warm uh i know st still a lot of snow pray for pray for those folks out in texas y'all uh i know a lot of folks out in texas are having you know they're i think it today is the sixth day they've had with no power and a lot of them with no heat so y'all remember them in your prayers 
Um, remember me? I don't know if you can see it in the background. Yeah, you can. Got my walker out today. I've been walking some. I've been having to take a pain pill, you know, to really, to really put some pressure on this leg. Uh, so it don't hurt so bad, but I've uh, been putting some pressure on the leg uh, And it's feeling good. I'm just taking it slow. I don't want to re-injure myself Y'all keep prayers uh, going for, for me on that on the leg. It's We're slowly progressing and thank you for all my new subscribers uh, I know uh, folks in the prepping community on YouTube are still sending folks over, so I really do appreciate that. Lord, we're at 10 minutes. I need to shut this thing down. Uh, but y'all, uh, hit the uh, like button if you would, subscribe. I don't know why anybody would, but if you wanted to do the notification bell, it'll remind you, or uh, every time I do a video, it'll say, hey, uh, the ugly just put something out. So if you wanted to do that, you could. We appreciate all of you watching. Uh, it's a dreary, cold day here in Alabama. All the snow is gone. It didn't. It didn't stay for very long. So thankful for that. God bless y'all, and y'all have a good one. This is the Ugly Prepper, and we'll see you next time.